welcome back to my channel. So guys, as you know, I've been getting a little bit more into the whole vlogging thing um, on my Breakfast at Freddy's series. And as today I have like a pretty eventful day, like compared to the last 18 months at least, I thought that I would actually do a day in the life of vlog for you guys. Now I'm not actually very used to this, usually the only times that I vlog like out and about are on trips um, and obviously I haven't been on a trip in a year and a half. Um, so this is definitely a one-off, although if you guys do really enjoy it then you have to let me know because I might consider doing more vlogs in the future. So please ignore the fact that I look like a racing driver this morning. Um, I'm about to do my hair, I'm actually shooting this morning so I'm up bright and early, the weather is good which I hope it stays good, I don't think it's going to, I think it's going to be quite in and out today. But I'm shooting my first ever reel and it's a sponsored reel and I've never done one before, I've been quite late to the party on Instagram, um, so I hope it goes okay. I've got my dresses for the day ready here, it's kind of a toss up between um, this one, which I feel looks like a figure skating dress, it's really cute, and then this one, which I think I might end up going for because I like the skirt a bit more, it's a bit more full, um, because basically I'm doing kind of like a transformation reel, so it's gonna go from like kind of casual to really, really sparkly. Um, so if anyone's wondering, these dresses are from Godiva. They were the only rose gold sequin dresses I could find at short notice. And then for the rest of the day, I'll be wearing this dress, which is a dress I just got sent by a brand called Leo and Lynn, or Leo Lynn. Um, it's an Australian brand. It's the most beautiful dress. It's very creased at the moment because I just washed it. So I've got my steamer here, um, ready to make it all lovely. Um, and you'll see it later when I have it on. It's just the prettiest dress ever. So my photographer, Michaela, is coming round to the flat any minute now. We're gonna shoot the first part of the reel in my lounge, which is exciting. And then my friend, Michael, is coming over to do my hair to give me like a really big OTT glam hairdo. And then we'll be heading into London to shoot the second part of the reel. I have like a couple of hours to kill before I have a few kind of like events and nice things on this afternoon and evening. And I will just say guys, that as like a day in the life goes. For me, this is a pretty pleasant one. Um, it hasn't really been like this for a really long time. Although I will say like a little bit of reality that shooting always gives me a lot of anxiety. I think it's just the Virgo in me, the perfectionist. Um, I always want everything to be perfect and I put a lot of pressure on myself. So I do have a little bit of like a fluttery heart this morning, um, but I always get like that when I shoot and I'm always happy at the end of it. So I really know that it's irrational and I need not worry, but for some reason I always do. So guys, I have about 10 minutes until my photographer gets here, so I'm just going to quickly do my hair. I'm not going to do anything dramatic because I still want to have that transformation of the hair. But as you guys know, I just hate my hair straight, cannot stand it, so I'm just going to put a few loose curls through it. And today I'm going to be using the new GHD Unplugged Styler, which I am so excited about because I just think it's the coolest thing ever. First of all, how adorable is the case? I'm obsessed with it. So it's basically a cordless styler, which is unreal. It has no wire, you can take this out and on the go with you. Um, it's incredible. For me, the thing that like always bugs me when I'm out like all day going from day to night is always my hair because it always falls flat. Like my curls always fall out. That's just the nature of my hair. It's so long and thick um, and silky that it's really hard for curls to stay in my hair for a long time. Also, especially when I had my fringe, by the end of the day, it would just be like flat against my forehead and it absolutely killed me. And I am actually thinking about cutting my fringe in again quite soon. So this will basically be the biggest lifesaver. So I'm just going to do some loose curls now with this and then pop it on charge whilst we shoot so it's fully charged for me to take out with me later. Guys, as you can see, you can literally get the exact same result using the GHD Unplugged as you can at their regular stylers. Although, honestly, I feel like this is too nice. I need to like brush this out, put it back in a ponytail because it almost looks 
too good. So now I just need to get changed. I'm wearing my under the story skirt and my little Wimbledon jumper, which is literally like my uniform at the moment. I just wear this every day. I just throw it on. It's so easy and comfortable. Um, but I'm going to pop on my little pink satin Victoria's Secret robe. Um, and Michaela should be here any minute. And then I'm just popping this little baby on charge so that it's all ready for when I go out later. So I'm all set up and ready to shoot with my lights up. The room is still such a mess, like there's so much that still needs sorting out. There's boxes everywhere. So I'm just gonna have to shoot um, cleverly <laughs> and try not to get all the stuff in. But yeah, I'm excited. the first section of the reel and it went really well so now Michael's gonna work his magic on my locks try out the GHD unplugged as well because you want to try it out don't you you're very saying. excited yes here we go <laughs> looking a bit strange in my jumper and this hair but it will all make sense when we get there i love my hair thank you michael you're welcome love it <laughs> <laughs> So this is the reality of shooting um, and the benefits of shooting with Michaela because she brings me a changing tent and to demonstrate. Oh my God. Oh, your own luxury. Yes. Changing, like sweet here. <laughs> so guys, we are at our location. Well, we're going to shoot around here. I don't know like exactly where, but everywhere around here is really nice. So I think we're just going to wing it. So hopefully it goes okay. Um, but on the tube journey, I've lost a few of my curls. So I'm just going to top them up a little bit with my GHD unplugged. Really, really handy. This is literally like my lifesaver because Michaela will know the thing that I'm always complaining about when we shoot is my hair. I'm like, my hair is so flat. My curls have dropped. I'm always having a freak out about my hair. So I'm really happy that now I can just give it a little bit of a touch up, add some little curls in where they've dropped and make it look nice and glam again. <laughs> Yeah, literally. Oh We're gonna come at us. Like Michaela, <laughs> I'm going to be. <laughs> very, very silly, the secret dress. Ta da! <laughs> I'm 
I'm literally making myself rose gold. Oh no, it's not blending in. <laughs> I'll look, like, I will. I'll look like the lady, like the busker in Covent Garden, like the rose gold lady. <laughs> All done. Yeah. <laughs> All done. Yeah. All done. I'll return back down to earth, having learned what love is worth. Will I burn or burst? I must have been dreaming. Still, I'm beaming, smiling from ear to ear. And if I was dreaming, then why is she still here? And if I'm dreaming, then why is she still here? So guys, I've just popped into the Landmark because it's one of my favourite hotels and I love just coming here for a hot chocolate or a drink. Um, but I thought I'd quickly show you the marble ballroom because this is actually where I had my school prom. And sometimes the doors open and I can take a sneaky look. So I thought I'd show you guys. Oh my God, it's so beautiful. So adorable. Oh my God, what lovely memories. Look at the chandeliers. This is like a major inspo for my flat. <laughs> Look at those curtains. Oh my gosh, it makes me so emotional, but I just had to show you guys. Isn't it beautiful? Imagine Freddie in her pink dress, dancing the night away in here. <laughs> if any of you guys have not been to this hotel, you are seriously missing out and you should definitely come here next time you're in London because it's so amazing. This is the Winter Terrace and it's kind of like outdoors, but indoors. It's so unusual and beautiful and look, it goes up so high. And I just love coming here if I have a couple of hours to kill for some lunch or a hot chocolate, to do some work, emails, to kind of sit and spend some time here because it's so lovely and serene. I'll return back down to earth having learned What love is worth will I burn or burst I must have been dreaming Still I'm beaming Smiling from ear to ear And if I was dreaming Then why is she still here? And if I'm dreaming Then why is she still here? So guys, I'm freshened up now. I've just taken off that eye makeup because it was gorgeous, but I feel like a little bit over the top for the daytime. And I'm in a taxi now. I love getting a black cab around London because I just feel like it gives me a few minutes to myself just to like check my emails, relax. Um, I just really love it. It's something I do all the time when I go out and about. Um, so now I'm on the way to a Pandora event, which is really exciting because this is like the first big event that I've been to since everything. Um, so it's really exciting. I'm gonna see Josie, Em, Emily, like probably loads of people that I know. And honestly, I can't wait. It feels like things are kind of back to normal, which is lovely. <laughs> Yes, yes, yes. No, because they're not going to have to 
could do it. Even if it's just you doing mundane things, you make everything look so fabulous. Absolutely. A mundane day with Freddie's life is like the it's most not magical. Oh my god! Mom said this to me the other day. My mum literally said to me, everything Freddie does is just magical and just looks. She just makes it look perfect. She just has an eye, and I was like, oh, yes, she does. Oh my gosh! Look who I found. My favorite. Instagrammer in the whole, not that you're just an Instagrammer, but you know, you do have my favorite Instagram account in the whole world. Oh, you have an amazing yeah, yeah. Instagram, and I love Freddie. She is so oh. nice. <laughs> Thank she is nice. you. She's really, really nice. And you look like a film star, of course. <laughs> Really irresponsible for you to go home. They don't grow like this in the cold. <laughs> it's all that pollution. Are you going to come and stay at mine? Are you going to come? Yes. It would be irresponsible to let you go home like this. Charlie, I have to stay with her. Charlie. Yes, I have the, the idea Mom. where we're going to go for drinks. As soon as I've done my thing, Mummy wants me to go. Drink. Drink. <laughs> Please, Joe, come here. You spilled something. Wine. <laughs> Freddy getting into a taxi. I'm coming too. <laughs> I guess you use less treatment and sweat. I don't know. I'm not treatment anyway. Which I've told you, Mary. Yes. Well, you both look gorgeous and radiant. So we're just having a pre dinner curling <laughs> session. <laughs> no. She's had too much. No, but crazy. it looks great. You both look so good. Josie just did hers. Now Freddy's doing hers. She's had, she I would not choose Josie's for her dresser. You can do it. I'm just going to do it. Okay. You can do it when you've had oh five glasses of rosé. So now Emily's getting involved. So this, I am queen of curling with straighteners. Then booster. Freddy is so pretty. Is your gravity hair? <laughs> not from the vegetation. Not from the chair. guys I'm home now after a really long day and I brought home a stray and she's wearing my pajamas <laughs> looking adorable and we're just gonna get snuggled and cuddle yeah. <laughs> going to watch it's not very long land. oh yes love is land <laughs> can we just tell your followers I've had my eyebrows microbladed which is why I look like I have got two Let's slugs see. on my face. They don't look... Oh, they're quite dark. Yeah, they're They'll quite go down dark. there. So, guys, I really hope you enjoyed that vlog. Do let me know in the comments if you'd like me to do it more often. I don't know if I'm very good at rose, it. Oh, yeah, Rosé. Oh, Christ in the almighty. Comments. <laughs> Every single comment's going to be like, Rosé! <laughs> Thank you so much for watching, guys. Bye! Mm -hmm.